be below freezing tonight. And with that comes a shortage of shelter beds in the Portland metro. Jennifer Dowling joins us live outside one of those shelters with how this weather is impacting those on the streets. Good evening, Jennifer. Good evening, Chris. It's really tough on the homeless at this time of year, especially with the temperatures being so cold. Behind me is the Human Solutions Shelter, and they provide uh, shelter beds for more than 100 families in this really needed uh, time. Now, we spoke to the family center manager, Dina DeChewy. She says that no matter what the weather, they are always at capacity here, and it's not uncommon for two to three families to show up in one evening, even more so with this weather, as some families that were living in cars must now come in because the weather is just too cold. She says it's a good time to donate now to charitable organizations because the need is so great. This is, is really a time um, where there's a lot of people out on the streets. Um, that, that the resources are really important to know um, that places that are feeding these families um, are, is a time in the Christmas season that I believe this is when it's really needed. Um, donating coats, et cetera, to organizations that then can pass those out to families, et cetera. Um, it's just a really important time of year to get those resources to families. And now, this shelter is only for families with children. Single adults will be turned away from the shelter. So, Gina says it's important for those who need a place to figure out the best place to go before heading to a shelter should call 211. She says the warming shelters do open up in the evening, but there, and there was one down the street, but the shelters vary on who they accept and who they don't. So again, calling that 211 number or going online to 211 is your best option there. Back to you, Chris. All right, great advice, Jennifer. Thank you. And 